know, this has been one hell of a week for me. You know, it's been like a lot of people that I have disagreed with in the past on a lot of different things. This week, this week it seemed like I'm kind of agreeing with them on some things. Umar Johnson, someone I have nothing in common with, someone I feel is a con man. But he said something about Dion that I agree with. When he said that Dion made a selfish move by going to Colorado, he was correct. It was a very selfish move. And I'm gonna tell you the reason why. Dion is like a kid who brings toys to the sandbox. And then once he leaves, he takes his toys with him. Selfish move. Now, Dion came to Jackson. He recruited the players that won him those championships. I get that. But my thing is, everybody is saying Dion did so much for Jackson, he changed the school environment, made it a winning environment. Yes, he did. I agree with that. But my thing is, Dion is leaving. And what is he leaving with? Dion is leaving with all his toys. Every player that he recruited, that he thinks can make it to the next level, he's taking with him. So where did I leave Jackson? At the bottom again. Just understand, Dion is taking 11 to 12 players with him. And then you add the players that are graduating. So you probably gonna lose anywhere from 10 to 20 players off, the, off this championship team. What do Jackson do for next year? They have to start over. They might win six games. They might win seven games, who knows? But we do know they will have to start over. Start over from recruiting. They don't even have a coach right now to start recruiting with. So Dion is leaving Jackson in the same shape he found it. Other than some new toys to play with like a new facility he's gonna to come to the locker room or a new practice field. Yes, he's leaving that. But when it comes to the team, he just blew it up, just destroyed it. So basically, Jackson got to start over from the bottom. So that's what I mean by Dion is being selfish. He's taking all his toys with him to Colorado.